Hey, what's going on, guys? My name is Kevin. If you're new to my channel, thank you so much for stopping by to check out this lesson. If you like it, please give it a thumbs up and consider subscribing. I would greatly appreciate it. If you are already subscribed, welcome back for this lesson. Uh, in this lesson, we're going to go over a new uh, Morgan Wallace song. This one is 98 Braves. So let's get zoomed in. I'll get this one broke down for you. All right, guys, for this one, we're going to be in standard tuning. I am two nine and a half steps, so I'm capoed on the first fret. But if you're in standard tuning, you do not need a capo. And the way I'm going to show you how to play this is kind of my take on the song. It's not exactly how the song goes. Um, I just want to throw that out there just before somebody says, hey, that's not how you play that. And guys, when you're doing these covers, kind of add your own take to it. Be creative. As long as you're playing it and somebody can say, hey, I know that song. Um, just have fun with it. If you add an extra note here or there, who cares? Uh, like I say, just have fun. And that's kind of what I did with this one. I just kind of gave it my own little take, and I hope you like it. It really, there's really only two chord shapes for this one, which is a, a D or a D sus two. A D sus two is you don't need your middle finger on the high E of that second fret. So I really have a D and a G, and that's kind of the basic two chord shapes. You will be doing this little walk here. So you still have that D shape, and you'll have your finger here on that A string of the fourth fret, and then you'll be putting your index finger on D. A string of the second fret on these little walks. Okay. So anyway, let's get into it. The intro will go this way. All right. And that's basically how the, uh, the verse is going to go as well. But anyway, I'm going to do a little hammer, oh, play the A string open, hammer onto the A string of the second fret, and then you can kind of give a down and an up pick on that open D. And then you can go into that D. Down, down, up on that D. And then you can do this little walk. So it's going to be down, 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 up, down, down, up, down, down, up, okay? So down, down, up, down, sorry. Down, down, up, down, down, up, down, down, up, down, down, up. Then you're going to have this little... Play the A string open, hammer on to the A string again on that second fret. Play the open D, open G, and then that D string on the second, I'm sorry, on the third, and then back to that open uh, G. And then play the D chord. So all that slow. Sorry. Just a little bit different. So you can play the uh, a low E open, hammer on to that low E of third, play the A string open, then play the A string on the second, and then play it. You can play that open A twice. So the whole thing slow. Let's try it again. And that is your intro. And like I said, the verse is kind of played the same way. Of course, is kind of 
up pretty much the same. Um, it's going to be just a little bit different, but you still did a little walk here. So that's one of the songs you can kind of have, just have fun with. So that uh, play, I play the intro, verse, and the chorus. Just kind of put it all together. That's it. You just go back to that little uh, intro part, and the uh, verse and the chorus is going to be the same. And uh, if you think I missed anything, just leave a comment. And I'll answer back, try to help you the best I can. Uh, leave a comment. Let me know what you thought of this lesson. And as always, please like and subscribe. Thanks for watching.